Hello and welcome. I am the Mecha Man. T H E M E K K A M A N. The Mecha Man. We are doing Mass Effect Monday, uh, where I do a uh, let's play of Mass Effect. Uh, I'm going through the trilogy. Uh, right now we're up to episode five. Five. Uh, right now we're up to episode five uh, for Mass Effect Monday. Um, on the live stream, uh, coincidentally, all this month I am doing month of August. I am doing uh, a charity event with uh, StackUp.org. Uh, for those that don't know, Chive Charities, uh, Chive Charities is a uh, from the Chive. Uh, they're doing a thing called Ten Percent Happier. Uh, I will leave uh, the link uh, below for that. Uh, for those that want to donate uh, to the cause, uh, for those that don't know, StackUp is an organization uh, that dedicates trying to bring video game video game uh, paraphernalia to those active duty overseas uh, in hospitals and um, veterans alike uh, especially for those that are disabled um, because video games as well as you all know uh, help bring um, help with PTSD, anxiety, uh, sometimes stress uh, I'll, there's a lot of benefits with the video games, uh, and that's what they strive to do with doing, uh, their bringing video games to, uh, those in active duty. Uh, there's my little bit of housework spiel, um, for those that don't know that are a part of watching, uh, the Let's Plays here on YouTube. Uh, I did make 100 followers on Twitch. Uh, I just logged in and saw that today, which means that um, if you watch this later, uh, I am doing a uh, giveaway for it. Uh, it will last roughly about a full month uh, for entries to be allowed. Um, for entries to happen, you must uh, follow me on all social media platforms. Uh, Twitch, Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, and YouTube. The, it's easy. They're all slash the Mecha Man. That will, probably, that will be in the links below as well. Uh, without further ado, we are going to hop right into this Mass Effect Monday. Maybe? There we go. I'm pushing the button. There it goes. We are resuming. Um, see me stretch forward. Uh, my mouse battery has gone low. So, uh, where we last left off last time, we are on the planet uh, looking for Liara, Dr. Liara Tassoni. Uh, so we are on, what planet is this? Uh, Therum surface? Therum? Therum surface. Therume Therum. Uh, I'm going to try and get to her as quickly as possible. Uh, for those that don't know, I'm actually playing on Xbox One. Uh, it is a Xbox. It is a backwards compatible game with a. Uh, 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 with Xbox. So. Um, and it is part of the. Oh, what is it? Um, uh, there are a few that they do. Uh, man, this thing drives like a freaking warthog in Halo. You can't always get it to be. I think now it's on the other side of me. And then it switched back. Like, it hits like. This is the first time that I've seen first person over the shoulder. And one side or the other. Got yeah, back up. Uh, because we are not doing. Uh, music during the plays. So we are relying all on the video game. Geth. Aha. Drive right over you. Ah, no, don't want to go that way. Uh, for those that don't know, I am playing as a 
Uh, oh, what is it? The tech one. I'm playing as the tech guy. I think this is the part that I hated. That's why. Only a fool punches a nap back in the mouth. We should sneak around and pull its tail. This is very Ah Aha. And level up. So he's he said only a, basically only a demos uh will uh try attack from the front and there we go. Oh my god. Oh, I can't do repair. Like, see, this gun, it's like tearing them apart. I feel there's another one over here. I know where he's at. Nope. Where's my run? There it is. A. Like, it, it wasn't that long ago when I did this. Okay, so there's nothing in this one, unfortunately. There is... This one. So, what we gotta do is we gotta open up that doorway and actually have to walk up some ramps here. Uh, I know that there's a dude in here. Dude with the dude. Thank you. Okay, and override. Uh, B ah! Yes, it's... There's the activate. Of you. Uh, for those that don't know from the last one, uh, you can actually run faster by hold having your weapon out and holding the shoot uh, uh, a on it. B B. Okay. Yeah. See, I I do better by saying those out loud. So please forgive me. There we go. Uh, the nice thing about Mass Effect 1 was that you had no reason Contact. Boom. 
die. Uh, these are actually out of random, so there's actually no real... It still thought that I was, uh, under attack for some reason. I would always sit there and try and push multiple different buttons. I mean, look at how slow that is. Versus this speed. Forgot whether or not there was something in here. Yeah, upgrade kit. One more grenade. Because I used one. They call them grenades. I. It is the epitome of a true two stick shooter. In the essence of hard to turn. So. I uh, gotta get back in my vehicle. Now that I have searched the whole compound, uh, I've actually done it once before. Just FYI. Uh, there's literally nothing back over there. It's just emptiness. Oh. Uh, I could go through and like close that off afterwards, but it doesn't matter. Um, it did allow you to. Drive into it, yeah. There we go. Shooting on the fly. Shooting while we drive. Shooting while we drive. Uh, your shields do regenerate. It's just... There it goes. Sure, of course. After you shoot, you know, because why would I catch you ahead and early? Uh, this thing drives very weird. It's very similar to that of a Warhawk. Yeah, uh, the nice thing is that uh, there's not really anything that you collect off of killing things. Uh, and everything is collected through uh, pickups. The, uh, yeah, you know, it's like it wants to like straighten itself out. Uh, you collect everything through the uh, pickups, which are uh, like in supply crates and stuff. So. Roadkill. Of course it's clear. I ran one over. We're gonna run them over. Drive a drive, drive a drive, drive. Hope everyone is having a great Monday. We are making great time on this drive. It's a lot of uh, driving somewhere. You're kind of. So I think the first time that I played. Did I skip one? Nope. That was my road kill. Uh, you're kind of supposed to be handheld to this spot. Um, 
for those that have played Andromeda. It is very similar. Uh, it is very similar to uh, Andromeda in the aspects of you kind of go and collect everyone. Can I do it? I did it one time where I went through and got that in there. What it is is that you're not, you're technically not supposed to go in there, uh, but I did it one time. Because they don't want you to because it's kind of considered to be cheating uh, because you basically kind of like dragon how's it going uh, did you were you the one that I was that your Twitter account uh, that I linked uh, yesterday and last night. Oh dang. Don't shoot me. There's a level up. See if I can, yeah, I can level up in the middle of this. Yes, you did. Uh, you did raid me with 23, and I appreciate it. I appreciate that. That was actually a uh, very generous of you. No, I have my chat up. It just, it didn't, it didn't pop. Like, I don't know why uh, sound effects were not, like, my sound effects weren't working. Um, I even tested it, like, after you were gone, and it just, it didn't pop at all. So I'm like, ah. Uh... Oh, damn. untrained on everything else yes I do do variety stream no this is not Andromeda this is uh, just uh, plain old Mass Effect 1 the old school the old school OG 1 And there's my frame drops. Question. I want to ask you because you are here. How bad are the frame drops? 
Uh, I actually have a Hophog HD PBR2. Uh, it is an older style, uh, but um, it actually has worked just fine. Like I can literally pause this stream and then continue, like end the stream and then go back into it, and it works just fine. Uh, so that's the guys. I'm getting stutter about every two to five seconds. If you actually bear with me, uh, I had to do this yesterday, and I've had to do this before. Um, I'm being told by Streamlabs that this is my internet. If you actually hold on for 10 to 15 seconds, I can actually stop stream, start it back up, and it runs just fine. Now it's at my 30 minute mark. Um, I really don't know what is going on, and I know it makes for horrible things. So please stay put. I will be back. Um, so yeah. Twitch says, great, I'm having excellent. Yeah, it's been happening. Started last week. My settings have been fixed, that's the weird thing, so um I'll still be in chat, so give it ten seconds, please. Okay, for those watching the YouTube, because I'm doing a live stream, for those watching the YouTube, you probably didn't notice anything other than me just hopping on here and saying this. Uh, for uh, Black Dragon, who is in my chat right now, uh, who stuck with me graciously enough uh, during the uh, uh, lag spikes of internet. Mm. Uh, we are having issues with teammates not wanting to go. Yeah. Come on. They try and go straight and they fall down. Let's see if we can get these guys around. Come on, guys. All right. Okay, there it goes. At low latency, high quality. Uh, so we're gonna sit there and uh, output enable advanced encoder settings. Yep. Uh, Low latency, high quality. The bit rate's at 4K, mine's not. Uh, only because I, uh, it's Xbox One. I don't have the Xbox One X, so it's not gonna be output to 4K, uh, which is kind of weird because it's a 720p game. That would be, it's uh, it's weird because it's a 720p game and because it's backwards compatible, it's being up to 1080p. Uh, and then my capture card is actually collecting it at 1080p and reducing it down to 720 uh, for me to stream it. So that is a totally weird thing. Mark to this so that way I can go back and read that later. 
Yeah, so that way I can kind of correct it. Uh, but we are coming up into here. I'm going to do a quick save because I know what is coming up. Those that don't know. Don't know. Well, now. Uh, there's a big battle going to be happening right here. I saved a good spot. Uh, the markers actually saved the stream stream with the chat. Freaking hate these things. I think I was ready for this. Yeah, I know. The stream looks totally fine now. It, it it's it's weird. I didn't touch any settings. It, it I, that's the weirdest thing. I I didn't touch any settings.
Nice because I saved right there. I'm so glad I did. Uh, and for stream service, fit rate limits. This fight is. Ah. Uh, this is. I actually feel like this is one of the harder fights in the game. And it's right out the gate. Blocked because I can't tell him. There it is. And there's everyone alive. Yay! Uh, All right. Not a problem, man. Have a good luck. Good luck on your stream. Uh, and. Oh, you're on mad. Okay, I was wondering who you, uh, where you were on. So I was like, uh, um, for those that don't know, Black Dragon was one, uh, someone that uh, raided me last night. Uh, go ahead and give him a follow. That's B L C K D R G D R A G N on uh, Twitch. Uh, and I believe I had that wrong on. Um, uh, in my tweet, which I uh, am fully sorry, uh, but for everyone else, I'm doing the the let's play. We are following and trying to find out where Doctor Liara Tassoni is. I tweeted the wrong person then last night. I am sorry about that. weird thing is like there's no answers no we're not we're not good until I say we're good ah oh, jeez bye black dragon thanks for sticking out uh, 
sticking it out with me. Put your shield down. All right, here we are. Are we talking with they are to Sony maybe? Wait, what was this way? Nothing. I just designed to look that way. Oh, I should have gone up to the force field. Oh wait, no, 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 that's the way out. Spoilers! <laughs> Spoiler! There we go. It still counts as one broadcast. Awesome. There we go. Did I? No, I have gear. Oh, all this nicer gear. Uh, shield bonus. Yeah, no, I want the shield bonus. Grades. An exit. Uh... Okay. I need to kind of readjust that. Have it go through its settings. That's my controller kind of making me run slow. I feel like I'm missing that conversation. To Sony, I presume. Thank you, Goddess. I did not think anyone would come looking for me. Listen, this thing I'm in is a Prothean security device. I cannot move, so I need you to get me out of it, alright? Um. There we go. Uh. Your mother is working with Saren. Whose side are you on? What? I am not on anybody's side. I may be Venezia's daughter, but Benizia's I'm nothing daughter. like her. I have not spoken to her in years. Please, just get me out of here. How'd you end up in there? I was exploring the ruins when the Geth showed up, so I hid in here. Can you believe that? Geth, beyond the veil! I activated the tower's defenses. I knew the barrier curtains would keep them out. When I turned it on, I must have hit something I wasn't supposed to. I was trapped in here. You must get me out, please. Your mother is working with Saren. Whose side are you on? What? I am not... I may be Venezia's daughter, but I'm nothing like her. I have not spoken to her in years. Please, just get me out of here. We'll find some way to help you. There is a control in here that should deactivate... Yeah, there is. There always has to be. You have to find some way past the barrier curtain. Okay. That's the tricky part. The defenses cannot be shut off from the outside. I don't know how you'll get in here. Be careful. There is a Krogan with the Geth. They have been trying different ways to get past the barrier. Radar, it appears to be jammed. I'm like, that's that's zooming in on it.
No. A X B. No. A X B. No. A X B Y. A X B Y. Huzzah. I think that's kind of a randomness thing. I feel like there was something up here. Yeah, right there. Come on, controller. Alright, yeah. There we go. Now we're getting some stuff. Okay, so there's nothing back there. We shall run back. I think there is something over here. It's worth a C, and you can't go up there anyways. I think I have to give my uh, controller a firmware update. Uh, for those that don't know, a firmware update. Yeah. Um. More basic armor. I don't have medicine. Oh, I need to do first aid. Sorry, okay. Uh, two points for you. Some warp. Be able to get you some throw. Get you some better shotgun. And I can't save. Awesome. Let's see where if I can. You lead. I'll follow. So I have ran into a section where I cannot save. Hopefully we don't die. Here we go again. Glitching in the elevator. Glitching in the elevator. So those that don't know, if you actually have the gun out uh, while going into an elevator. Oh, how did you get in here? I didn't think there was any way past the barrier. We blasted through with yeah. a mining laser. Of course. Yes, that makes sense. Please, get me out of here before more Geth arrive. That button over there should shut down this containment field. Now, as far as I remember, there's certain romance options that you can do in this game, and I believe Liar to Sony is one of them. I know Tally is another. Get out of this place. There is an elevator back in the center of the tower. At least I, I think it's an elevator. It should take us out of here. Come on. There it is. Saving content. Thank you. I, I still cannot believe all this. Why would the Geth come after me? Well, that was a very weird face you had. Yes, involved. Seren's looking for the conduit. You're a Prothean expert. He probably wants you to help him find. No figure. The conduit, but I don't know. These ruins are not stable. That mining laser must have triggered a seismic event. Whoops. We have to hurry. The whole place is caving in. Joker, get the Normandy airborne and lock in on my signal. On the double, mister. Aye, aye, Commander. Secure and away. Eight, eight minutes. He needs to move faster. If I die in here, I'll kill him. If you die in there, you will kill him. Um, not making sense.
case you yeah. didn't notice, this place is falling apart. Exhilarating, isn't it? Thanks for getting rid of those energy fields for us. Had the doctor over. <laughs> Whatever it is you want, you are not getting it from me. She'll stay with us. Yeah. Not an option. Saren wants her, and he always gets what he wants. Kill her. Spare the Asari if you can. If not, it doesn't matter. Why is Tali dying? Who is still alive? Why does Tali die? Someone tell me. Sound doesn't sound nice. Uh oh. We got. Ah, uh, crap. For those that don't know, it's loud for me too. Turn that down. That was loud for me, too. There we go. I'm sorry for the loudness on that. Too close, Commander. Ten more seconds, we would have been swimming in molten sulfur. The Normandy isn't equipped to land in exploding what do you volcanoes. Mean? They tend to fry our sensors and melt our hull. Just for future reference. We almost died out there, and your pilot is making jokes. It's a coping mechanism. Yeah. You used it. I see. It must be a human thing. I don't have a lot of experience dealing with your species, Commander. But I am grateful to you. You saved my life back there. And not just from the volcano. Those geth would have killed me or dragged me off to Saren. Yeah, they probably would have. What did Saren want with you? Do you know something about the conduit? Only that it was somehow connected to the Prothean extinction. That is my real area of expertise. I have spent the past 50 years trying to figure out what happened to them. Hmm. How old are yeah, you? Yeah. I hate to admit it, but I am only 106. Damn. I hope I look that good when only I'm Only 106. A century may seem like a long time to a short lived species like yours. But among the Asari, I am barely considered more than a child. That is why my research has not received. 106 is a child. Because of my youth, other Asari scholars tend to dismiss my theories on what happened to the Protheans. So let's... I'm sorry for the loud noise. So let's get the strip. Um, a hundred... She said a hundred and something? A hundred, five, hundred fifty, somewhere around there years. Protheans last came 50,000 years ago, so that's... 500. Only 500 times longer. So if 100, 150 is a child, that means adult. Okay, let. Mm, uh, adult would then be, let's say, a thousand years old. So, hmm, an adult is a thousand years old. The last time they came and wiped everyone out. That's adult is 1,000. So let's say 10,000 being dead. The last 50,000 years, only five generations have passed. Generations had passed. I just wanted to make that clear. Did your research turn up anything interesting? What is interesting is what I Interesting is that you're at 50,000. There's remarkably little archaeological evidence of the Protheans, and even less that might explain why they disappeared. 
It is almost as if someone did not want the mystery solved. It is like someone came along after the Protheans were gone and cleansed the galaxy of clues. But here is the incredible part. The Reapers. According to my findings, the Protheans were not the first galactic civilization to mysteriously vanish. This cycle began long before them. Where do you come up with this theory? I thought there wasn't any evidence. I have been working on this for 50 years. I have tracked down every scrap and shred of evidence. Eventually, subtle patterns start to emerge. Patterns that hint at the truth. It is difficult to explain to someone else. I cannot point to one specific thing to prove my case. It is more a feeling derived from a half century of dedicated research. But I know I might. Feeling. Eventually, I will be able to prove it. There were other civilizations before the Protheans. This cycle has repeated itself many times cycle? over. Cycle? What cycle? What are you talking about? The galaxy is built on a cycle of extinction. Each time a great civilization rises up, it is suddenly and violently cast down. Only ruins survive. The Protheans rose up from a single world until their empire spanned the entire galaxy. Yet even they climbed to the top on the remains of those who came before. Their greatest achievements, the mass relays and the citadel, are based on the technology of those who came before them. And then, like all the other forgotten civilizations throughout galactic history, the Protheans disappeared. I have dedicated my life to figuring out why. What she just said is that the Protheans, those that existed before us, i.e. human race, uh, were smart enough and the Reapers came through and wiped them out. They made these mass relays, but only she just then stated that the mass relays were there prior to uh, the Protheans, so therefore were, were the mass relays like there by the Reapers designed to be able to expand the intellectual knowledge of intellectual species to spread them out, spread, spread out so that way they can then harvest Brain power? They were wiped out by a race of sentient machines. The Reapers. The... The Reapers? But I have never heard of... How do you know this? What evidence do you have? There was a damaged Prothean beacon on Eden Prime. It burned a vision into my brain. I'm still trying to sort out what it all means. I should have played as a female for this. Yes, Bam that shop. makes sense. The beacons were designed to transmit information directly into the mind of the user. Finding one that still works is extremely rare. No wonder the Geth attacked Eden Prime. The chance to acquire a working beacon, even a badly damaged one, is worth almost any risk. But the beacons were only programmed to interact with Prothean physiology. Whatever information you received would have been confused, unclear. I am amazed you were able to make sense of it at all. A lesser mind would have been utterly destroyed by the process. You must be remarkably strong-willed, Commander. Okay, this isn't helping us find Saren or the Conduit. Of course, you are right. I am sorry, my scientific curiosity got the better of me. Unfortunately, I do not have any information that could help you find the Conduit or Saren. What good are you? I don't know why Saren wanted you out of the picture. But I think we'll be a lot better off if we bring you along. Thank you, Commander. Saren might come after me again. I cannot think of anywhere safer than here on your ship. And my knowledge of the Protheans might be useful later on. And her biotics will come in handy. Look at how detailed he is. Versus how detailed uh, Commander Shepard is. Good to have you on the team, Liara. Thank you, Commander. I am very grateful. <sighs> I am afraid I am feeling a bit <sighs> lightheaded. When was the last time you ate or slept? Dr. Chakwa should take a look at you. It is probably just mental exhaustion, coupled with the shock of discovering the Prothean's true fate. I need some time to process all this. Still, it could not hurt to be examined by a medical professional. It will give me the chance to think things over. Are we finished here, Commander? We can talk again after you've seen the doctor. Dismissed. The rest of you. Dismissed. Mission reports are filed, Commander. You want me to patch you through to the council? Yeah. Sure. Patch him through, Joker. We'll continue more conversations. Now, We've received your report, Commander. I understand Dr. Tassoni is on the Normandy. 
I assume you're taking the necessary security precautions. Dick. Don't tell me how to do my job. You are free to act as you see fit, Commander. Our role is to offer guidance and advice. It's up to you if you're smart enough to listen. Liera's on our side. The guests were trying to kill her. Benezia would never allow Saren to kill her daughter. Maybe she doesn't know. Or maybe we don't know her. We never expected she could become a traitor. At least the mission was a success. Apart from the utter destruction of a major Prothean ruin. Was that really necessary, Shepard? The Geth were crawling all over those ruins. We were lucky to make it out alive. Of course, Commander. God, I hate that guy. Must always take priority. Good luck, Commander. Remember, we are all counting on you. God, I hate that guy. Anyone else really hate him? Let me do some Spectre training. So, yeah. So spectre training. Try and do this quick. Map. Uh, we're going to save it right there. There is conversations that I could be doing. I'm going to go down there so that way I can have them prepped uh, ahead of time. Did I, did I miss something? Uh, I'm going to go down there and we will start those uh, conversations on the next installment. We uh, just got uh, Dr. Lear to Sony uh, in this episode. Uh, in our next episode, we will continue our conversations with uh, Dr. Lear to Sony. Who's around here? Yes, who shall be around here? Uh, thank you guys so much for watching the Let's Play. Uh, for those watching in live stream, I greatly, greatly, greatly apologize. Uh, for some reason, my Streamlabs is having an issue of now 30 minutes in, where it just it. I guess it's having problems processing uh, the information. Uh, but I'm getting massive frame drops in the middle, uh, and you probably noticed that right before. Um, all of a sudden being smooth and I said welcome back uh, and you didn't notice it uh, For those watching live stream you notice and we dealt with uh, probably 15 20 minutes of uh, off and on uh, Connection wise, so uh, I apologize. Uh, I will be looking into that um, uh, Little side notes. Uh, I also have and I'm gonna have this pop back up on to stream Right there, uh, I am doing the Chive Charities, Chive Charities, uh, which is thechive.com, uh, is doing a charity event for all month of August, uh, which is called 10% Happier, um, where other charities kind of strive and challenge each other to try to see who can raise the most money uh, within the month time period, uh, and you know, winner gets uh, extra bonus out of you know, Chive Charities as uh congratulations uh there are first second and third prizes so it's not like oh here you go you won um so there's that uh, i am on the team for stackup.org those that don't know what stackup.org is uh, they're an organization that uh strives to bring video game video game paraphernalia uh, to those that are active duty uh and veterans uh disabled uh veterans that are disabled and active duty as well uh what it does is that uh, video games and video game paraphernalia actually help with um, PTSD, depression, anxiety, uh, and a whole bunch of other things which greatly, greatly increases morale and pretty much existence of life because then it gives them something that they can do uh, with those issues. Um, also, um, what else is it? Uh, I am doing a $25 gift card giveaway. Uh, I had just, by the recording of this, when I hopped on, uh, noticed that... Okay, uh, my chatbot just had a little hiccup. Uh, upon starting the recording of this, uh, I had noticed that I was having a... Uh, I reached the 100 follower milestone on Twitch, so uh, thank you guys so much. Uh, and in doing so, I'm doing a $25 uh, gift card giveaway. It will be for uh, Xbox, PlayStation, uh, Nintendo eShop, and 
uh, Steam uh, one gift card for one lucky winner. Uh, I'm doing a Gleam giveaway, so therefore I can make sure that everyone is following on all of those in order to receive uh, said gift card. Um, uh, no, the latest follower has not been announced. So, um, but I don't, I don't know if it popped up. There it is. All right. Uh, that was the most recent, uh, follower. I just wanted to sit there and, uh, I like to do the shots. I like to give everyone the thank yous that they deserve. And by doing so, I put them on live stream um, yeah there it goes uh, so there is that uh, I, I did notice that I will have to do a little bit of editing uh, on this scene um, I don't really use it very much though um, but thank you guys so much I am the mecha man uh, in order to do the that giveaway you must be following me on twitch twitter instagram facebook and youtube uh, I am the Mecha Man. All those are slash the Mecha Man. T H E M E K K A M A N. The Mecha Man. I thank you guys so much. Have a good one and peace.